and they're all in line. We are ready for the start. They're off in the facing Tipton lure. And it is Solemn Tribute who comes out running on the lead. Shining Copper goes with Solemn Tribute early. And Full Mast is away running in third behind them. Conquest Typhoon and Ecto are next. And then comes Jay Gatsby. Offering Plan is down on the inside. And saving ground early on here. Seven lengths off of front running Solemn Tribute. Solemn Tribute's out there on the lead as they make their way toward the backstretch. Shining Copper's been taken to the outside now to be a neck behind after a 24 and 1 opening quarter mile. And that it's full mast in third. Ecto is fourth on the outside. Conquest Typhoon follows in fifth onto the backstretch. Six lengths from these dueling leaders. And then offering plan in Jay Gatsby at the back of the pack. Up the backstretch. And it is Solemn Tribute. Pushed along here by Shining Copper and Full Mast is right behind them after a half mile and 47 and four fifth seconds. And then it's Ecto running in third near the inside, three lengths off the lead, and now going by Full Mast as they race for the far turn. Offering Plan has been guided to the far outside and is now running in fifth. And then it's Conquest Typhoon and Jay Gatsby around the far turn. It is still Solemn Tribute. Shining Copper, now Full Mast, is coming up after them. Ecto is down on the Inside, waiting for a spot to go. Jay Gatsby has been sent on the far outside. And then it's offering plan and Conquest Typhoon. They're into the stretch. Shining Copper. Shining Copper on the outside of Solemn Tribute. Ecto is closing through on the inside. Full Mast is there. Jay Gatsby offering plan. Needs a path through late. They're coming into the final 16th. It is Shining Copper in front. Here's Full Mast. Jay Gatsby on the outside. The three of them are coming down to the wire together. Oh, it is very close. Very close between Shining Copper and Jay Gatsby. Between those two was Full Mast and then came Offering Plan and Ecto. The final time was 1 minute 40.80 seconds and an absolute thriller in the face of Tipton Lure.